We'll guide you through how to copy and paste in Minecraft Java. If you guys find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So just before we get any further, cheats do need to be enabled for this to work because we're going to be using a command to go and do this. But before we get any further, a big shout out to our sponsor, Apex Hosting. Apex Hosting allow you to go and create your Minecraft server with ease. They've hosted over 300,000 Minecraft servers. They've got 24 seven servers and support so you can get help from experienced server administrators whenever you need it ultra latency and so many other awesome benefits. So if you're interested, there'll be a link down below in the description and the comments. And at the moment, you can get 25% off your first invoice as well. So go and check them out. But back to the guide. The next thing we need to do is go and enable coordinates. To go and do that, you press on the F3 button on your keyboard. And as you can see, it then goes and enable them. And what we need to do is go and look at the coordinates here. You've got your X coordinate, your Y coordinate and your Z coordinate. So now what we need to do is go to the lowest point of the build and go to the corner. So for example, if you've got a floor and things like that, you may want to dig down a few blocks. In this case, I'll just do it from this level here and then make sure F3 is still selected so you can see your coordinates and open up your chat by pressing on T on your keyboard. And what you need to do is type in slash clone. So clone is a command which allows us to go and uh, copy and paste things essentially. And now go and type in your coordinates. So keep them in the same order and you put a space in between them. So mine is minus 34, then 63, 128, just like so. Hit enter and then that will go and send it. Now don't worry, you'll go and get an error. We're just doing that so it goes and saves the current uh, coordinates. And now what you need to do is go to the opposite corner of the build and go to the highest point. And what you need to do is make sure you go high enough to go and include the roof as well. And of course, make sure you include everything. So I'm going to go from here and then fly up and flap a bit more just to make sure it's all included. And then open the chat again by pressing T. And now what you can do is press the up arrow key. And that will then go and bring up the last message or command you sent, which is the, the sort of half command we entered. And now you need to go and enter your current coordinates here. So they, this is minus 23, 71, 118, just like that. And then what you want to do is press enter again. Once again, the command won't work and it will go and fail like mine did there. And now what you need to do is choose where you want to go and paste it. So in this case, I want to go and paste it over here. So then once you're in the destination, then what you can do is press the T button to open the chat, press the up arrow key and it'll bring in your last sent message. And now we can go and enter in the coordinates for the destination. So in this case, I'm at minus 45, then 64 and 162. And now when I go and press enter, just like that, it goes and copies it and pastes it. And what we can do is close off the coordinates and I go inside and everything is exactly the same. We've got the furnaces, the anvils, everything is there. And it's that simple. And now once you've gone and copied and pasted it once, you've basically got the whole command set up. So then all you want to do is let's say I want to go and paste it again. I could come over here and then what I can do is open my coordinates again by pressing F3. I'll go and press T to open the chat, press the up arrow key to bring back the last sent message. I'll delete that last um, set of coordinates just so I can then enter the new one. So in this case, we're at minus 58, uh, 64, 150. And then what I can do is press enter. And just like that, once again, we've gone and pasted it again. So it's that simple to copy and paste in Minecraft Java. And then what you could do is go and do that again and build a whole village by just copying and pasting builds. It's super awesome um, and it's a really useful command. So if you guys found this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video and go and check out the channel for more Minecraft guides on a range of different topics from installing mods to using commands and all sorts. And once again, if you do want a Minecraft server, then go and check out Apex Hosting. They're linked in the description and the pinned comment. They're my favorite Minecraft hosts and they've got so many awesome features on there as I went through earlier. So make sure you go and check them out if you need one and a huge thanks to them for sponsoring this video. Have an awesome day, guys.